Hello, my name is Maria Vignola. I am the lead game designer on Assassin's Creed Unity Companion app. And today I will show you a little demo. So the main feature is the, uh, the world map. So basically this is the exact same world map that you can play with uh, you can, in the Assassin's Creed console game. You, can, you have all the collectible icon, all the main path, uh, mission icon, uh, side quest, you can select each icon and uh, identify the reward for each mission. Um, you also uh, can track the character here. So this is flashing because we are currently connected to uh, a console. So if I move my character on the console, the icon will move as well. And the red dot here are the enemies around me. So it's very useful as a second screen experience. I can also place marker from the companion app, so I'm here, and if I place a marker, uh, the marker will be automatically reflected in the console game, which is good and which is cool because it allows like co-op gameplay at home. I can play with somebody else who's placing marker for me. Um, so we have an interactive map. We have also two unique uh, gameplays um, that all the gameplays will unlock exclusive content in the console game. The first gameplay is uh, called the Glyph Puzzle. So each time you unlock a new uh, landmark in the console game, it becomes available on the companion app and you can uh, play the, the Glyph Puzzle on it. So basically each landmark is uh, in full screen in the app. You can double tap to uh, trigger the eagle vision and identify the glyph. So on this building, this is Saint Chapelle, I need to find uh, three hidden glyphs. This one is quite easy because it's a, it's a tutorial one, but uh, as the game goes on, you will unlock more complex landmark, so the glyph puzzle is going to be more and more challenging. Each time you complete a glyph puzzle, it unlocks a new nomad mission on the companion app. Um, a nomad mission is highly inspired by the, ba the BAM system uh, that we use for um, the Assassin's Creed 2 game. So basically it's cooking mission. Uh, each mission has three steps. So uh, for each step you can assign up to four assassins. Each assassin has stats, uh, has health also, and each mission has requirement skill. So for this mission I need a lot of stealth and a lot of attack, uh, so I need to assign the best assassin as possible to complete this mission. Once you reach the 100% out of success, you can launch the mission and then you wait. But the good thing with this is once the mission is going to be completed, a new reward will be unlocked in the console game. 63 rewards can be unlocked by the companion app. We have chest, uh, assassination mission, uh, unique gear, uh, stuff like that. So 63 reward total. One important thing is the rewards are not mandatory to complete your uh, Assassin's Creed Unity game. You can, it's, oh, it's purely a bonus, but it provides a lot of money and things. So, so we have a map, interactive map. We have gameplays uh, that unlock exclusive reward in the console game, and we have also uh, many comfort features. My favorite one is the heat map. So, the heat map are made of real player data. So, as you progress in the game, you will unlock more and more heat map areas. Uh, this is the player path in Paris. So all the players, they play in the, um, uh, on this island and they mostly go everywhere. The most interesting thing with the heat map is the heat map in for the main path mission. So once you unlock a new mission in the console game, you don't need to complete that mission. You, don't, you just need to unlock it. Its heat map becomes available. Let's see. This is the heat map for the mission uh, graduation. Um, 
So this is the player position, so where they, they go during the mission. We can toggle between different type of layers. So we have position where the conflict start, desynchronization, kills, crit point. So each time you select a new layer, the heat map uh, refresh and uh, you get new uh, data visualization on the, on the app. Um, another interesting feature is also uh, the gear loadout. Because in the, in the Triple E game, uh, everything is around Arno customization, gear, skill. It's very important for the player to learn uh, how he should um, customize uh, the avatar. To help him, we have designed most basically um, a catalog. Uh, you can browse through all the, um, all the item, all the weapon, all the, all the outfit. Also, uh, you can identify all the mo modifiers. Uh, if you have a requirement before a requirement to get this item, the, uh, the companion will tell you. Uh, you see how this item will influence your uh, meta stat for your character. So we cannot equip uh, an item on Arno uh, via the companion app but uh, it's a good tool to plan uh, your next purchase while you're on the bus, for instance.